From the setup of our incredibly likable protagonist to the smart world building, the bits of mystery, and the insane level of quality far and above what one would expect from a seasonal fantasy anime, this had all the makings of a hit show, a diamond in the rough if you will. However, unlike midlife crisis adventure, this protag won't ever come to understand his strength to the point where there is no rhyme, reason, or logic to just how dense he has to be in order to uphold the OP clueless main character gag. Honestly, it's a shame as every other aspect of the show is on point. So so if you can look past that or even enjoy the trope, then this is an instant watch. We follow Noor, who lost both of his parents at a young age. Growing up in their remote home hearing tales of adventures, he travels to the capital to try and become one. However, after 18 months of training at the various schools, he only manages to learn the most basic skills of each one. Returning home after being denied the privilege of becoming an adventurer, he trains the very few minor skills he knows relentlessly for over a decade in the mountains, especially his parry skill. Eventually, he is able to parry a thousand swords in a single breath, but without a higher level skill, he can only become an epic adventurer. Thus begins his journey all the way from the bottom. The setup is classic and executed so well, but as I said, with how dense they have Noor being and the confirmation that he will be this way for the foreseeable future, it's a sad state of affairs. OLM is behind this and they have been the champions of underdog anime such as Apothecary Diaries in these past few seasons. They have done an amazing job with this adaptation thus far, and while I won't be watching, I'm sure they will keep up the great work. As for our lead VA, he is an industry veteran with many roles under his belt. While he hasn't had a breakout role thus far, his voice work in this one was good and I have no doubts that the quality will stay high. If this sounds good to you, the link to check this out is in the description YouTube thinks that you'll like this video and subscribe for more quick seasonal spotlights.